Good morning, happy hippo! Today, Miss Yari has a story about a moose. And the title of this book is If You Give a Mouse a Muffin, what do you think it's gonna happen? Let's find out. If you give a moose a muffin, he'll want some yam to go with it. So you bring out some of your mother homemade blackberry yam. When he's finished eating the muffin, he'll want another and another and another. When they are all gone, He'll ask you to make more. You have to go to the store to get some muffin mix. He'll want to go with you. When he opens the door and feels how chilly it is, he'll ask to borrow a sweater. When he puts the sweater on, He'll not rise, one of the buttons is loose. He'll ask for a needle and thread. He'll start sewing, sewing. The button will remind him of the puppet his grandmother used to make. So he'll ask for some old socks. He'll make sock puppets. When they're done, he'll want to put on a puppet show. He'll need some cardboard and paint. Then he'll ask you to help make the scenery. When the scenery is finished, he'll get behind the couch, but his antler will stick out. So he'll ask for something to cover them up. You bring him a sheet from your bed. When he sees the sheet, he'll remember he wants to be a ghost for Halloween. He'll try it on and shout, Boo! It scared him so much, he'll knock over the paint. So he'll use the sheet to clean up the mess. Then he'll ask for some soap to wash it out. He'll probably want to hang the sheet up to dry. He'll go outside to put it on the clothesline. When he's out in the yard, he'll see your mother blackberry bushes. Seeing the blackberry will remind him of her yam. He'll probably ask you for some. And chances are, if you give him the yam, he'll want a muffin to go with it. And that's the end. Bye, happy hip.